SpaceX's Starship program faced another major setback on Wednesday when its Starship upper stage crashed in the Indian Ocean. The 403-foot Starship's ninth test flight started rather smoothly, leading many to believe that it might be successful. But then began the real trouble. Welcome to Spin the Globe, where we delve into stories from around the world with depth and insight. SpaceX's Starship failure follows two consecutive Starship test flights earlier in 2025 that also ended prematurely, highlighting the technical challenges that SpaceX faces in developing the world's largest and the most powerful rocket system. While the SpaceX Mega rocket got farther in the test than the last two flights, it lost control on the re-entry to Earth. Around 30 minutes into the mission, SpaceX confirmed a fuel tank leak aboard the vehicle. This mission was still historic as the flight marked the first time SpaceX used a recycled booster, which detached its planned and headed towards a splashdown in the Gulf of Mexico. SpaceX, the upper spacecraft often referred to as the ship, was not able to deploy eight dummy satellites as hoped. Mission controllers lost control with the spacecraft, which began to fly erratically due to a leak in its fuel tank. SpaceX CEO Elon Musk took to X to share that the spaceship did not make it to the scheduled engine cutoff. He added that the leaks caused loss of main tank pressure during the coast and the re-entry phase. However, despite the setback, SpaceX's persistence in pushing the boundaries of space flight remains unwavering. Each test flight, even those ending in failure, provides critical data and lessons. As SpaceX analyzes the latest setback, anticipation continues to grow for next flights. If you like this video, then like, share, and subscribe to ET Now.